Bajar is well known name across in not only in India even in adjoining countries. We have in India almost close to nine factories, and all the factories are dealing with all the category categories of the products. And uh, we have uh, almost 150 branch offices or depots, and these depots are all spread out all across India. In, within the state, we have multiple depots, and almost close to 2,300 plus people are working for Berger. And we are using a state of art. Uh, uh, technology to manufacture the product and uh, which is very uh, say at times it looks very simple though it's very complicated. Everybody in IT used to always feel uh, there shouldn't be any issue because as and when an issue comes up then always there is going to be a challenge resolved because the time is always been a, one of the bigger challenge uh, what, would, what would be the best turnaround time etc. So all these challenges we have uh, across the application. As and when any issue comes up, yes, we have to see through each and every component individually and there is a separate team working on a separate layer. Log analytics, where it is really making a lot of impact is basically uh, uh, having a consolidated backend environment and a, a user-friendly dashboard. And uh, right now, to start with, we have deployed typically a EBIS or a Oracle EBIS system application. and. Uh, it's getting, I mean, we are further rolling it out to CRM. These two are the most important critical applications. We are also going through a lot of trans digital transformation. So under this digital trans transformation, we are bringing in new technology, new applications. So yes, there are critical customer facing uh, applications. CRM definitely happens to be one of them, as I mentioned earlier. It's a revenue generator for us. This definitely is going to be uh, a part of the uh, this thing, uh, implementation for the log analytics beside the ERP. As a man, if there is an issue, the log SR has been raised to Oracle on application layer or database. Uh, as a standard process, they will send certain scripts and they will ask for certain logs. The once you have provided, then it has to go through this kind of journey. And the lapse time is always going to be high, irrespective of whatever you do in to expedite it with all the best of your intentions. But this uh, post log analytics, learning and uh, artificial intelligence. It has really uh, uh, showed the difference between inefficient system and efficient way of working. That is one, and speeding the speeding up the process of resolution. That's another differentiator which I, just I personally believe and experienced. So across all the products, we are we, we do have a plan to uh, use log analytics to have a consolidated view, one single view, and uh, the kind of depth it provides in terms of reaching out where the problem is and identification of the problem itself. The ease uh, of triaging the issue is very comfortable and I would say is very easy. It covers all the technology, all the environments together and then point out where the problem is and how and who should act on this.